Uh, it is 3.30, very late for a Naruto manga chapter. Sorry, 3.40, very late for a Naruto manga chapter, but I decided to stay up to bring it to you guys. Naruto manga chapter uh, 688. This is going to be off Manga Panda. And the title of the uh, the title of the chapter is actually very interesting. It's called The Shotting Gun. So I don't know if this has to do with Obito Shotting Gun, the fact that he crumbled away last chapter, and somehow through his you know deterioration, his eyes are left behind. I'm guessing it has either something to do with Obito Shotting Guns, and maybe Kakashi gets them, or Sasuke Shotting Guns, or something to do with the shotting gun overall. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this live reading. Uh, let, leave your thoughts about the chapter in the comment section below. Also, be sure to like and subscribe. I greatly appreciate that. But anyways, let's just get into this chapter. Like I said, it's going to be off of Manga Panda, if I didn't mention that already. Um, so here we go. Uh, chapter 688, The Shotting Guns. Oh, wow, it starts off where the last chapter ended with Obito and Rin. With tears streaming down his cheeks, 688, the shotting guns. Okay, so he grabs, she grabs his hand, and I guess he's hesitating or something? Rin, would you wait for me just a little longer? Obito. What? At least while I'm away, wait, at least while I'm away at that world... It may take some time, but as indirect as it is, I'd like to do it this way. Who are you going to save this time? It's Kakashi. I finally got to be alone with you, Rin. I don't want to ruin everything by bringing him here. Plus, he can't be... He can't be much even if he came. The most he could be was an actual scarecrow in the battlefield. And that pisses me off. So I guess the fact that he, him leaving, him leaving is just something that Obito isn't able to just allow because Obito's, Kakashi's probably devastated at this point. Despite all those problems you had with him, you still, you're still pretty good friends, aren't you? Th that's not true. We're like oil and water. So <laughs> the fact that he still wants to help out his buddy is pretty awesome. But it's like, how does this make sense, though? Like, he's dead. Or at least he's just trying to... His will, it, I guess his will is still around? I don't know. I, I This is going to be very controversial. Um, could you get there immediately? Yeah, our chakras have the power to connect both worlds. I'll go check Kakashi out then. Wow, and he kamoys, dude. I'll be waiting here for you. Sorry, Rin. I'll be back as soon as possible. This is nuts. Oh, yeah, see, it's like his will or his chakra or something to do with him. Dude, yeah, see, like, the, the embodiment of his chakra is just forming, and it's, like, surrounding Kakashi now. Obito. Oh, wow, and it's just, like, Obito sees him as a child, as, like, a young version of himself. So it's just, like, I guess it symbolizes, like, what they represented as kids and they just want to keep that, you know, that that bond, I guess you want to say, versus how they turned out when he's older now. Uh, Obito, hey, came back to remind you not to come over to the other world so quickly, you know. Obviously, he doesn't want him to die right away. He has so much more to live for. Uh, after all, I did just give you... Wait, after all, I did just give you the eye as a present for becoming a Joni. It would suck to have to return... Ha it would suck to have it returned to you, Obito you. But then again, it's not like I'll be living in your world anyways. That aside, I told Naruto just a while back to become Hokage. The thing is, I told him to be the seventh. Kakage, Kakashi, you'll be the sixth Hokage? What? Dude! Even though you haven't officially started, I'll give you another present. It may expire, but it's definitely not something useless. You understand? You haven't gotten that. You haven't forgotten that you're pretty damn famous, aren't you? Kakashi of the shotting gun, dude. He's giving you both his shotting gun, dude. Dude, how? He has no senju... De I mean, I'm like... I'd, I'm hyped? But at the same time, it defies the logic of Naruto. Like, first off, Kakashi's not an Uchiha. 
Second, he has no Senju DNA, so th like, and the fact that he always had his Sharingan covered, it's like now that he has both Sharingan, they're both, as this picture shows, they're both Kamui activated. It's like, how does that conserve his chakra? He's not able to turn them back unless throughout this war he's just had an immense chakra reserve. Dude. I'm not going to front, though. He looks boss with those two shotting gun. And then on top of that, it's like, how did you get... How did you implant your eyes and take the other ones out? Like, you know, what became of those? Or maybe he just infused his chakra and, you know, the essence of his Keke Genkai into Kakashi and, you know, made it that easier. But that's just sick. Like, Kakashi has both Kamui. I wonder if he's able to get the infusion of the Kamui and, and, and the Mangekyo Sharingans and have the Susano and form a Susano. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know. Uh, but anyways, Black Zetsu. Oh, yeah, the arm. Naruto chopped it off last chapter. So the arm, uh, Kaguya's arm is ripped down, the one that has Black Zetsu in it. Um, oh, and Naruto pinned it down with those uh, black rods. So, all right, now he can't move. Next page. Uh, the Susano. Um... Sasuke Susano is going in. Oh, dude, did Kaguya get sliced? Oh, no, Sasuke got flung. Let's do this, guys. Oh, yo! What? <laughs> dude! 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 I'm so fucking hyped right now. A while back, and this is obviously already, I mean, you could already predict this, but a while back, a few chapters ago, I made a predictions video of what I wanted to see from Naruto regarding his power-up of the, of, of the Sage's Six Pads, and I said I wanted to see him do a different Rasen Shuriken variation of every tailed beast. You got Kurama, uh, the Hachibi, the, 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 the six tails, the five tails, and the rest of them. I don't remember all their names. Dude, it shows all the tailed beasts up top, and then at the bottom, dude, oh my fucking god! You got the Molten Rasengan. Uh, you have the, like, the, 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 the blue-flamed Rasengan, which I said that would be awesome if you got the blue flames from the, from, uh, from Mata, Matatabi, the, um, the two-tailed cat. Um, you have this one, which looks kind of like the bubbles from Saiken, the, the six-tailed slug. Uh, I can't, I really don't know what to make of the other ones. That one's obviously, uh, Cho, uh, uh, Chome, the, uh. No, not Chome, uh, Kokuo, the uh, the five tailed the five tailed horse, because it shows like the wind. But these look so boss, dude! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tailed beast, super tailed beast. Oh, Sage Art, super tailed beast, Rasen Shuriken. Oh my God! Like I'm just stuck on this chat. I'm just stuck on this page, right quick. Oh my fucking god, dude! That's so boss, so fucking boss. Okay, I'm gonna change. I'm gonna turn the page now. I just want to see the damage that it does. All right, Kaguya. She looks like she's activating. Oh wow! When Naruto threw all nine of them, she's activating Byakugan. What it seems like, and they seem to have connected. They made a giant explosion. Sasuke looks like he got caught in it a little bit. Uh, Sakura. Is that Sakura that saves him? I don't know who that is, but it looks like Sasuke stuck his... Oh, no, that's Naruto. That's Naruto that saved him. You see the, the Gorodamas behind him. Uh, nice one, Naruto. And you got Kaguya here. Oh, dude. What the hell? All the tailed beast natures, when they hit her, I guess they reacted to her chakra. And it seems like it... I don't know what the hell's going on with this. It can't be Mom here. What the fuck is that? Dude. 
What the fuck is that? <laughs> it's like a manifestation of all the QB, all the, the fucking tailed beasts together, but it shows Kaguya's, like, eye amongst them. What? It's still that huge? What's that supposed to be? Anyways, a fox, a raccoon, a badger, or could it be a rabbit? Who cares? That makes it a lot easier to approach and seal it. Isn't this a humanoid? This thing didn't become a, uh, a juby under mother's orders. It could be the cause of Naruto's previous attacks. The tailed beast called from the called to one another and turned into that. Isn't it unstable? Isn't it sta It isn't stable. Oh my god, dude! She just like leveled up. Kaguya got like all the. I think she absorbed that, to be completely honest, because she was lacking chakra, and she didn't go to a different dimension to, you know, restore her chakra like Black Zetsu said. She got her arm cut off, and I think when Naruto hit her with all nine of those unique tailed beast chakra natures, she absorbed it, and then it created like an unstable reaction. A combination of all nine tailed beasts of the fact that she is like the original fucking. Shinobi, I guess you want to say. Uh, dude, she just blissed all of those fucking shadow clones. Sasuke, avoid the white hand. It'll swallow you up in a second. And it's too damn fast. I know. Sakura, dude. Sakura! Sasuke, use your eye technique with Sakura-chan. Oh, dude. Did she get caught? Oh, no, he grabbed her with the Susano. Sasuke, eh? Yeah? Susano, Susano, who's that? What's all this? Dude! Dude! Don't fucking tell me. Kakashi Sensei? Thanks. Dude! 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 Dude, don't fuck it. Oh my fuck. <laughs> Thanks, Obito. No way, that's impossible. Well, that's that's why he called. Well, that's why he's called the famous copycat Kakashi of the Sharingan. All right, Sensei. But he wasn't supposed to have the Sharingans. This time, I'll protect them and protect the fucking world, dude. Oh my goodness. Kakashi, the fate of the eye. Let's rewrite the future. Dude. Oh. My. Fucking. <laughs> I, also, I also did another prediction video in the past that Obito would be the one to awaken a Sharingan because of the fact that he got both his Mangekyo Sharingan and it's obvious from the track record of Uchiha's. Uh, Shisui even had an, uh, a Susanoo, but it wasn't canon. It wasn't in the series. Itachi had one. Madara had one. They both had Mangekyo. And it's like, where's Obito's, you know? And Obito gave his eyes to Kakashi. Granted, the methods of how he went about it. How is it that Obito is dead and he manages to transcend you no know, limbo, in a sense? His last bit of willpower to give his eyes back to Kakashi, well, his original eye back to Kakashi, and the second one back to Kakashi. Kakashi gets a Mangekyo power-up, two eyes, two Kamoys, and I guess that initiates the fact that he's able to now copy even more accelerated versions of Jutsus, henceforth, the Susano. He's not an Uchiha, so it's not a Keke Genkai that he himself can master, but it's the fact that he has... Dual, Kamui, dual Mangekyo Sharingans to the point where he is the copycat ninja, and I feel like he copied that variation of Susan. I don't think it's Obito's essentially, because it looks more like Sasuke's. But now, Kakashi is going to save the fucking day, dude. Granted, you know, I don't know, there's no, at this point, at this particular point in the Naruto verse, I mean, it's already been stated before, where the fuck is the logic? You know what I mean? Kakashi, I was very 
dissuade by the whole theory of Kakashi's going to get the Sharingan. Kakashi's going to get two Sharingans. When the entirety of Naruto, he's had his headband covering his eye to conserve chakra. Whenever he used Kamoi in the past, I, I remember he used like Kamoi once or twice and he was out for like a week. He couldn't use his chakra. He had to build it back up. And I feel like since this war has started, Kakashi's been spamming his Kamoi. I think even since the pain, you know, the, the pain arc, um, he's just been spamming Kamoi over and over again. He hasn't lost its light. You know, what's going to happen when you use it up so much to the point where you go blind and you need, you know, another source of light? So it's like, it's things like that that I can't, I love Naruto to the point where I'm able to overlook these because I appreciate what it is, but at the same time it's like, dude, you need to stick to your fucking facts, you know what I mean? Like, you need to stick to the fact that Kakashi doesn't have, he doesn't have fucking, he doesn't have Senju DNA. He's not Nuchiha, okay? I can understand someone like... Donzo, you know, he had Senju DNA, you know, which gave him the suit, the, 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 the shot and guns in his arm and Shisui's eye. I can understand that. I can even understand the fact that Obito, granted half of his body was crushed, he also had Senju DNA. You know, granted he's an Uchiha, he can manage his eye, but it's like, I don't want to get into like the nitty gritty of it because I still, at the end of the day, I, I enjoyed the chapter. I liked it. Um, Obito is officially gone. He left a parting gift to his best friend, his dual Mangekyo Sharingans, to the point where now Kakashi has the upper hand now. Sasuke is pretty much down a little bit. You know, he got flung a little bit from the blast of the Jubi attack, uh, as well as, you know, he wasn't able to use his eye quick enough to save, um, to save Sakura. Naruto, he's, you know, gathering himself, you know, after dealing his attacks and stuff like that, and just... You know, relaying the effect. You know, relaying the battlefield. Kakashi saved Sakura. Kakashi has a Susano. So I'm fucking hyped right now. Like <laughs> a Susano, dude. I and and I don't know. Like it, it claims like he's the copycat ninja. So I'm assuming, I'm assuming that he copied the Sharingan. Okay, I'm assuming he copied Sasuke Sharingan Jutsu technique. And if not, then that must be the Susano that Obito would have originally had but now it's just been transferred to Kakashi. Like I said, Susano is a form of a Keke Genkai, so it's like, I don't know how Kakashi can manage something like that, but overall, the chapter was really great. Uh, I fucking fanboyed a lot this chapter, particularly the Naruto, Naruto with his nine-tailed beast, uh, Rasen Shurikens, which I did a prediction video a while back, talking about how I wanted Naruto. You know, we saw the um, we saw the, the the cursed seal. We saw the one-tailed Rasengan. And then we saw the the four tails, the molten Rasen Shuriken. So I was like, that'd be awesome if you just see a different chakra nature of every single type of chakra nature of every other tailed beast that he's had. And we saw it this chapter. It was fucking awesome. I fanboyed the hell out of it. You guys will be able to see it again if you guys are just getting here now. But, um, I mean... For the sake of substance, it was a good chapter. It was a very hype-worthy chapter. Kakashi has recognition now. Kakashi's back in the game. You know, a lot of people were like, oh, he has no Sharingan, so now he's useless. But now, granted, the methods of how he got it are very questionable to the source material and, you know, the past evidence of why it, this shouldn't be happening. But at the same time, it's like, Kakashi's relevant. Kakashi's going in. Kakashi has the spotlight. He's going to be the one to protect his, his students, to protect the Shinobi world, to live on with Obito's, you know, legacy of his eyes and to protect, you know, to, to take over as becoming, even becoming the sixth Hokage, which remember, he was also a candidate for the sixth Hokage before Tsunade came back around and, you know, after Donzo uh, had passed. So, um, overall, really good chapter. Very some very unexpected things, you know, with Obito's, you know, return, you know, Obito's brief return. Um, the tailed beast, I guess. I want to say Kaguya absorbed the the jutsu, uh, those tailed beast natures. It's the only logical. It's the only thing that would logically make sense. But um, yeah, I enjoyed the chapter. Let me know what you guys thought about it. What you guys think about Obito's, you know, methods of giving him his eyes. Uh, let me know what you guys think about, you know, the how Kaguya situation, her manifestation, how she's transforming with the Tailed Beast Natures, the nine Rasengans that Naruto pulled off, and ultimately Kakashi with a Susano. Let me know what you guys think about the chapter, what you guys liked about it. Overall, some major plot holes, but at the same time, it's like, you know, it's Naruto. I, I, I gotta, you know, I gotta appreciate it for what it is, not what I want it to be, even though, like I said, it's very 
it's a very touchy subject for me personally because I want to see the good. I see the good in Naruto. I don't really want to nitpick or bicker about you know certain things, but I do understand where there are problems, especially considering this chapter. But like I said, let me know what you guys thought about the chapter. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to like and subscribe. Leave your comments in the comment section. I will get back to everybody. But that's all I've got for this chapter. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next week. Take care.